Greenland Sharks. Imagine having to wait a century to find the love of your life. Such is the life of the Greenland Shark, a 5 meter long predator that may live more than 400 years, according to a new discovery, making it the longest lived vertebrate by at least a century, almost twice the lifespan of the old giant tortoises or bowhead whales. So it should come as no surprise that the females are not ready to reproduce until after they hit their 156th birthday. Landing a rocket vertically. In comic books and cartoons, you usually see rockets landing on planets and moons vertically. But in reality, achieving this feat is incredibly difficult. However, the private company SpaceX successfully landed a rocket vertically on April 8th and they did so on a floating autonomous drone ship. Their success will save a lot of money and also time between launches. Eternal Data Storage Scientists at the University of Southampton have successfully used a nanostructured glass to create a process for recording and retrieving data that is capable of surviving for billions of years. The scientists have made a major step forward in the development of this small device. It can hold 360 terabytes of data and remain intact up to 1000 degrees centigrade. This means that its average shelf life when held at room temperature would be approximately 13.8 billion years. A ninth planet. Before the discovery of Pluto in the 20th century, it had been theorized that a ninth planet existed beyond Neptune due to gravitational clustering that could only be caused by a massive object. It was then believed that this planet was found in Pluto, but that never fully quantified the gravitational distortion until scientists at the California Institute of Technology, Constantin, Betigin, and Mike Brown presented evidence that a ninth planet truly does exist with an orbital period of 15,000 years, and they are calling it Planet X. Klingon Newt This intergalactic amphibian is just one of a staggering 163 new species found along the Mekong River in Southeast Asia. The newt's toes and tail are creamsicle orange, a striking contrast to its ochre brown torso. Its head is shaped like a hexagon, but its defining feature is a craggy ridge of bones along its back and skull. Altogether, the creature looks remarkably like a Klingon, or rather, a Klingon's forehead that somehow sprouted tiny limbs. A second moon. NASA has just declared that Earth appears to have a second moon that has been orbiting ar around our planet for nearly a century. This new asteroid, called 2016 HO3, orbits very far from Earth and is more gravitationally affected by the Sun than Earth. But it does orbit Earth as well along its orbital path of the Sun. Don't get too excited about walking on it one day, as it is considerably smaller than our natural satellite with the dimensions of 130 to 350 feet across. Breast Cancer Treatment The combination of the drugs Lapatinib and Trastuzumab were used as treatment for a group of 257 women with HER2 positive breast cancer. And the results were incredible. In just 11 days, some women's tumors either completely disappeared or shrunk significantly. The results of Cancer Research United Kingdom funded trial presented at the 10th European Breast Cancer Conference in Amsterdam could lead to fewer women needing chemotherapy. Energy from the raindrops. A downside to solar panels has been their inability to function well during rainy days, but a team of Chinese scientists could make it a tremendous ally. They've developed a solar cell with an atom-thick graphene layer that harvests energy from raindrops, making it useful even on the gloomiest of days. Water actually sticks to the graphene, creating a sort of natural capacitor. The sharp difference in energy between the graphene's electrons and the water's ions produces electricity. Turning Carbon to Stone Carbon capture is an important part of maintaining the balance of CO2 emissions on the planet. Scientists in Iceland may have found a way to permanently capture carbon emissions. They pumped CO2 into a volcanic rock in Iceland, which sped up a natural process that turns basalt into carbonate minerals, which then become limestone. This process normally takes hundreds of thousands of years, but the scientists in Iceland were able to do it in only two years. 
The result is carbon capture into a rock that could be stored underground or even used as building material so that the captured CO2 never re-enters the atmosphere. Long Lost Nuke A man diving off the coast of British Columbia, Canada may have stumbled upon a nuclear weapon that the United States lost decades ago. The man is named Sean Smirachimsky, was using an underwater scooter to hunt for sea cucumbers near Pitt Island. When he came upon a bizarre object that looked a bit like a half-cut bagel the size of a king-sized bed. He told CBC, Now, the Royal Canadian Navy is scoping out the strange object to see if it is indeed a Mark IV bomb that was jettisoned by an American pilot in 1950 just before his plane crashed. 